Hi, everybody. So we're going to do a little poll here today. Are you ready? Okay. So let's have a word about power. And who has it and who doesn't? Okay. You ready? All right. Now, do you think power should come from someone who looks like this? Oh, she just hates that she has some makers to you. Don't you just hate that? Don't you? Don't you just hate that? We're all about love. We're all about love. Oh, those mean old Romans. We knocked over those Aphrodite statues so many times because it was just an accident, we swear. We swear. And those mean old Romans came and, and, and made my face look like this. Look like this right here. Oh, he looked like a man. My mouth looks like a penis head. It looks like a hole in a penis. <laughs> uh, do you think power comes from someone who looks like that? According to some people. I have a different interpretation of power. Power is not something that you need to have fear to be used as an adjunctory mechanism to need or to have it or to attain it or anything like that. It's just, to do that is sort of, um, I think it's a weakness, don't you think? Because fear is a power exchange between the fearful and the feared. And that which the fearful are always afraid of, they're going to have the ability to be controlled with, right? Power doesn't have to be fearful. Power can be... Power can be... Oh. Different. In fact, power... Power can be fun. Power plays can be even better. Now I know what you're thinking. <laughs> What does this guy know about power? Hmm. Well, maybe... You didn't know me as well as you thought. Hmm. Nah. Power plays are fun. As a certain blonde Canadian I once knew said, Turn about. It's fair play. Hmm. And so, power can be subtle. Power can sometimes not be recognized by someone who, like, it can walk itself up and introduce itself to you and say, Hi, I'm Kasten. What's your name? And you have no idea that who you're talking to might be someone who has gilded executive authority before. And power in physical might. Power in a bed. Hmm. Power is a very interesting thing. As Buffy the Vampire said, it once said. Hmm. Power. I have it. They don't. And this bothers them. So, I think that power can oftentimes come in the form of a handshake. Sometimes it can come in the form of politics, sex, maybe a bite. And if you don't think that, well, someone like little old me could influence with power, then you have no idea what I'm capable of. Wouldn't it be sweet to find out? <laughs> and 
in the cell. Power. Often an elusive thing. But for those that have it, we always do. Because the truly powerful don't need to make you feel afraid. About anything. When the truly powerful come for you. Just sort of come for you. We don't care if you're afraid. Or not. Call frequency 315 As Jared Nielsen once told me, turn it back, boys, it's fair play. They started it. I'm gonna try everything right now. Fuck me. Or fuck him. Like me. You know what? I can. Hmm. 